guys and welcome to my conservatory uh, and welcome to the start of your design and manufacture course. I thought I'd do everything on video for you and I'll talk you through everything as we go. But before we start, I'm going to need you to get some resources together. So one of the things that you're going to need, an A4 ring binder. We'll keep all of our work in here and we'll keep it in one place and we'll get organised. So get an old one, I got this one out of a skip or go to Asda, get a brand new one, it doesn't matter as long as you've got a ring binder. You're also going to need some paper, okay, you can get pre-punched uh, paper at Asda in, in a folder, or I've just got a ream of paper, so I've got myself uh, a hole punch so that I can punch it before I put it into the folder. Some basic stationery, a uh, ruler, some kind of pencils, uh, and then some really essential stuff, a glue stick. You're going to need a, a Pritt stick of some type so that we can cut and paste and put things together. You're going to need some scissors for cutting out images and things. Uh, and you're probably going to need either some sellotape or some masking tape uh, as well. Right, let's get started then. Um, presentation is really, really important and organising your notes is crucial. So I've made myself uh, a little printed sign for the front of my folder. You might want to do the same. But don't worry if you haven't got a printer at home. All of this can be produced manually with coloured pencils, basic stuff, pair of scissors, stick it down. Now on the uh, Google Classroom I've posted an initial introduction which I've printed out. You don't need to print this out because you can keep it on your Google Classroom. It's just an introduction to the course. But something that you will need inside your ring binder are two dividers. Okay, I've actually made these dividers myself uh, because I, I didn't have those little sticky tabs. So you're going to have one for skills and you're going to have one for knowledge. And everything that we learn in this course is either going to be knowledge that you must understand or a skill that you've got to develop. Okay, and there's a lot of skills to be developed over this course. Now on these two dividers, I've also put these onto the Google Classroom. So if you have got a printer, print them out. If you haven't got a printer, write them out. It's crucial that you get these two lists, one of skills and one of knowledge, because we're going to be using these to tick off, as we go through the course, what we're learning uh, and how we're developing our skills. So you'll be able to keep track of what you're doing throughout the course. Okay, So there on the Google Classroom, you can print them out. If you've not got a printer, don't worry. Just write them out by hand off the screen. It'll help you to understand where we're at. Okay, And then you need the two dividers for your A4 ring binder. Okay, uh, And the first task that we're going to do, I'll make another video for, uh, is looking at the design factors so that we can start by analysing a brief. Okay. Video number one. 